the, one of our biggest strengths is our uh, communications and, and logistics and then that always rolls out into uh, incident management or um, you know RCS systems um, and so we really started to see the value of of incident management um, and uh, yeah so a few months after that we had another large um, training exercise a urban search and rescue exercise um, it was a mass casualty exercise like 60 patients yeah, that was a scenario, and and then again we're able to fine tune um, us using uh, using incident management and and really customizing it for for our our needs, and then um, also using the built-in um, forms and 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 systems that's uh, that it came with, um, you know. And coincidentally, uh, we had a few of these training exercises right before the the large floods that hit uh, KwaZulu Natal um, mm. earlier this year in April and um, we were in a in a position where we could roll out incident management quite comfortably um, within the greater organizations that that we were working alongside with and then we we're able to provide um, a, a much yeah a really well structured uh, incident management platform um, within the organizations that we're working with so you know that really was the the background to us um, uh, using d4h and where we got to and now and and i think we are obviously still learning the 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 system and really I think starting to master it and um, and customize it a lot better to to suit our organization and and I think also just getting that buy 